Welcome to the nostalgic world of Leave it to Beaver, a classic TV series that transported viewers back to the idyllic suburban landscape of the late 1950s. As we explore the timeless tales of the Cleaver family, we invite you to reflect on the charm of this iconic show. Perhaps you have a favorite classic Hollywood actor whose portrayal resonated with you, or maybe there's a cherished memory associated with the series that holds a special place in your heart. Before we dive into the random facts about Leave it to Beaver, consider sharing your thoughts on the classic Hollywood actor who captured your admiration. Alternatively, reminisce about a personal memory tied to the show that has endured through the years. We'd love to hear your stories and experiences in the comments below. Now, let's unravel some intriguing tidbits about Leave it to Beaver. Did you know that the series originally aired from 1957 to 1963, offering a snapshot of American family life during an era of innocence and simplicity? The show centered around Theodore Beaver Cleaver and his misadventures, providing a lighthearted yet insightful portrayal of growing up in suburbia. As we journey back to Mayfield, the fictional town where the Cleaver family lived, it's fascinating to note that the series was one of the first to depict the everyday challenges of adolescence. From schoolyard antics to parental guidance, Leave it to Beaver struck a chord with audiences by capturing the essence of family dynamics in a bygone era. So, whether you're a longtime fan or a newcomer to the world of Leave it to Beaver, we hope these insights add a layer of appreciation to this classic TV gem. Share your thoughts, favorite moments, or personal connections in the comments below, and let's celebrate the enduring legacy of this beloved series. In addition to portraying Ward Cleaver, Hugh Beaumont took on additional roles behind the scenes for the series. Not only did he contribute to the script of one episode and several others, but he also directed 23 episodes. This multi-talented involvement showcases Beaumont's versatile contributions to the 1957 TV series Leave it to Beaver. The character Ward Cleaver left a lasting impact, earning a notable recognition. TV Guide ranked him at 28 in their list of the 50 greatest TV dads of all time. This acknowledgement underlines the significance of Ward Cleaver in the realm of television fathers. Adding a layer of real-life reflection, still the beaver revealed that Hugh Beaumont, the actor behind Ward Cleaver, passed away in 1977. This tidbit connects the series to the broader timeline of the actor's life. These facts provide a glimpse into the multifaceted nature of Leave it to Beaver, showcasing Hugh Beaumont's behind-the-scenes contributions and the enduring legacy of Ward Cleaver as a memorable TV dad. Jerry Mathers, the star of the 1957 TV series Leave it to Beaver, made a pivotal decision that marked the show's unique place in television history. Despite the series maintaining good ratings, Mathers, upon entering high school, expressed his desire to retire from acting and focus on education. Consequently, the production was halted, making Leave it to Beaver the first primetime American production to have a series finale. This move by Mathers added an unusual twist to the show's success story, diverging from the typical reasons for ending a TV series. The decision reflected the commitment to education over the entertainment industry, setting a precedent for young actors in the years to come. Leave it to Beaver, unveiling hidden details in the quaint world of the 1957 TV series Leave it to Beaver, where family dynamics took center stage. There's more than meets the eye. Beyond the familiar facade of the Cleaver household lies a fascinating tidbit that adds a layer of intrigue to the show's history. Surprisingly, the iconic Cleaver house wasn't just a set. It became a permanent fixture at Universal's backlot. Constructed when filming transitioned to Universal, this house went on to star in various television programs and movies, becoming a standout attraction on Universal's tour. Over 40 years after the series concluded, the enduring set is affectionately known as the Cleaver House. This revelation peels back the curtain on the show's behind-the-scenes legacy, showcasing the lasting impact of Leave it to Beaver beyond its on-screen narratives. The Cleaver House, once a backdrop for family moments, now stands as a testament to the enduring charm of this classic series. The Cleaver household in Leave it to Beaver holds more hidden details than meets the eye. Beyond the family dynamics portrayed on screen, 
the iconic Cleaver House became a permanent fixture at Universal's backlot. Constructed during the show's transition to Universal, this house played a starring role in various TV programs and movies, even becoming Marcus Welby's house in Marcus Welby. M.D., one of Hugh Beaumont's final acting appearances, just a year before his retirement in 1970, was as a guest star on Marcus Welby, where the esteemed Dr. Welby resided in the Cleaver House. The coincidence adds a layer to the enduring legacy of the Cleaver House and Hugh Beaumont's career. This unexpected journey from the Cleavers to Marcus Welby showcases the lasting impact of Leave It to Beaver on television, bridging two iconic shows through a shared backdrop. Ward Cleaver's sleek exit down the driveway in the opening credits of the final season of Leave It to Beaver wasn't just a stylish departure. The car he drove had its rear window removed to combat glare, a practical solution for a smooth scene. But, beyond the on-screen details, the cars of Leave It to Beaver held their own off-screen significance. Wally's choice of wheels, a 1953 Chevrolet Bel Air convertible, brought a touch of classic style to the show. Meanwhile, Eddie and Lumpy opted for older models, with Eddie behind the wheel of a 1947 Dodge and Lumpy cruising in a 1944 convertible. These vintage rides reflected the era's automotive charm and subtly added character to the lives of the Cleaver family and their friends. While the show's focus was on the Cleaver family dynamics, the choice of cars showcased a meticulous attention to detail, contributing to the overall authenticity of the series. The cars weren't just props, they were a subtle reflection of the time, enhancing the nostalgic atmosphere that defines Leave it to Beaver. In the end, the show's commitment to authenticity extended beyond the scripts and set design, right down to the choice of cars. Wally's Chevrolet, Eddie's Dodge, and Lumpy's Ford weren't merely modes of transportation, they were symbols of an era, each with its own unique touch. These small but deliberate choices contributed to the show's enduring appeal, making Leave It to Beaver more than just a sitcom it became a time capsule, capturing the essence of 1950s America through the lens of its characters and their iconic cars. And that's a wrap on the hidden details of Leave It to Beaver's automotive history, a subtle yet significant aspect that adds another layer to the show's enduring legacy. This glimpse into the world of classic cars takes us beyond the scripted narratives, offering a peek into the meticulous choices that shaped the iconic series. As we bid adieu to the charming world of Leave It to Beaver, let's take a moment to journey back to the idyllic 1950s suburbia, where the Cleaver family taught us timeless lessons in love, laughter, and the art of growing up. The quaint town of Mayfield may be a relic of the past, but its impact on our hearts and minds remains evergreen. As you reflect on your personal connection with this iconic TV series, let the nostalgia transport you to a simpler time, where life's problems could be solved with a warm family dinner and a heart-to-heart -heart talk with Dad. Whether you resonated with the mischievous antics of Beaver, admired the wisdom of Ward and June, or chuckled at the timeless humor sprinkled throughout, Leave It to Beaver etched itself into the cultural tapestry. Now, it's your turn to share your favorite memories, the moments that left you smiling, or the lessons that still guide you. Was there a particular episode that tugged at your heartstrings or a character whose quirks you found endearing? Your stories add another layer to the legacy of this beloved series. Let the comments section be a virtual living room where fans gather to share the warmth and nostalgia of Mayfield. Your words not only celebrate the show but also weave a collective tapestry of shared memories that transcend time. Thank you for taking this trip down memory lane with us. Your stories make the legacy of Leave It to Beaver richer and more vibrant. Until next time, stay nostalgic, stay curious, and stay connected to the timeless tales of Mayfield. Your memories keep the spirit of the Cleaver family alive in our hearts.